my wife got a new cup. After this, we're getting tacos. Hola. Welcome to another edition of Redbeard Food Reviews, mobile edition. Today, we have something very special. We have tacos, which is not special for us, but they're at a different location we've never been to in a marvelous little town called New Hope, Pennsylvania. And the first thing you gotta know about New Hope, Pennsylvania is cha-ching, cha-ching. Everything is expensive there. It's almost like Pennsylvania Disney. And it's crowded during the summer. There's a lot of people. A lot of motorcycles go there, a lot of people walking. So we just had to walk through hell and back to get these tacos. I hope you like them as much as we like them. Let's take a look at the food, shall we? You got tortilla chips. Hopefully they're fresh. We have an order of carne asada tacos with the radishes. My wife doesn't like, so I'm gonna eat these right here. And underneath, no folks, it's not Mexican pizza. Although it looks like it, it's called the Thayuda, which is pretty much like tortillas, chorizo, Oaxaca cheese, avocado, which look like piecles, and salsa. Mm. The place we ordered these tacos from today is in New Hope. It's called Los Catrinas. It's a little shop. It's right next to the New Hope Visitor Center. And there's like a lot of restaurants on that little road there. But we saw a Mexican and we said, by golly, that's what we gotta get. So we got three tacos, which my wife is currently eating, and a thayuda. Let's see how they are. My, 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 where should I go first? Well, you may need a knife and fork, but you can probably just kind of pick it up and like, like fold it over. So let's just try one of these little avocados first. Yum, yum, yum. So the tacos are double shell, which is a good sign of quality. My wife took all the radishes off. Let's just go in for a little piece here. Let's just get, you know, you know, just take a little piece right here. Mm. Steak's good. Thin. Salty for me. Definitely need a little Oaxaca cheese on there. But my wife got them plain. We all know how that goes. Definitely no sort of seasoning on them. Kind of like just a regular plain meat. Uh, they have carne asada, they have al pastor, they have linguilla, or linguaya, which is the beef tongue. Oh, beef tongue, I should have got the beef tongue. Let's wash this down with a nice sip of glass bottle Coke, which is a sign of refinement. <sighs> Nothing beats that real sugar flavor. Well, I ripped a piece of the thayuda off, so can't wait to bite into it. Mm. It's got a good smoky flavor. You got the chorizo on there, sour cream. It's kind of like Mexican pizza. That's what, that's what it is. Chorizo is pretty good on there. Like a black bean sauce. Not bad. Pretty good. It's not overwhelmingly flavorful. Uh, the chorizo you have to have on there to have any sort of flavor. Because the avocado, the Oaxaca cheese, lettuce, tomato, doesn't really have a lot of flavor. So if you get the thayuda, you have to get a protein on it. You can either get chicken, steak, or chorizo. I opted for the chorizo because I like a little spice in my life. Uh-oh, what do we got going on here? What do we got here? A little bit of salsa. Yeah, a little salsa. Not bad. It's like a tomatillo sauce. Pinky's out. Oh, oh, that's a lot of garlic. Oh, oh, I wasn't ready for that. Oh, it's not really hot. Yeah, it is. It's, well, it's hot and it's kind of like Tingly. Tingly is a very good word. Woo. Let's try to cool it down with some of this Tayuda. 
P.S. The Thayuda is very messy. I don't know why I keep ordering these messy foods. It's like, why? Just, just get something you can just plow in instead of having to rake your facial fuzz out. You can definitely tell it was, it was it was baked in an oven. It's got that like oven kind of flavor, like it picks up everything that was cooked in the oven. Pretty good. Well, it's time for a wrap up of this meal at Los Catrinas in New Hope, Pennsylvania. The overall vibe of the place is very, very modern, very kitschy. It's a very eclectic crowd. Very eclectic, I would say. Uh, you got anyone from grandmas to bikers rolling around down in New Hope. And it's like, that, that's the whole vibe of the town. It's free, it's, you do whatever you want. Overall value for your money, the Ayuda, three tacos and two sodas was $26.50. So the most expensive thing was the Thayuda, which was $12.95. And for 13 bucks, a little, it's a little personal Mexican pan pizza. Flavor could be a little bit better. Uh, the flavor itself is not as strong. Uh, it's, the steak is very plain. The most flavorful thing on the Thayuda is the chorizo, so you have to have some sort of protein on it, or else this is not gonna be as flavorful as it should be. The rest of the menu has a lot of authentic things and not so many authentic things. They have tacos, they have burritos, uh, they have the Mexican flatbread pizza, the Thayuda. They have uh, enchiladas, I saw sopas on there, and empanadas. Overall, Los Catrinas, New Hope, I'm gonna give you three. Three out of five red beards. Uh, location, location's nice, but it's a pain in the balls to park. You're gonna have to park in down by the Playhouse down there, the New Hope Playhouse, or you could park at the Delaware Canal Park. $20 a day to park, so it's almost like going to the shore. For those reasons, and the lack of flavor, I'm gonna have to give you three out of five red beards. Well, that about does it for another edition of Red Beard Food Reviews. You can find me on the tweeters, the tweets, the twonkers. You can find me on the face space. My, I didn't even use MySpace. I don't even know what the hell my name was on there anymore. It's probably still my name. You can find me on the YouTube, which you're currently viewing this on. But you will find me for the rest of this day, try to polish off this here. Hopefully I'm saying that right, because I've been saying it like that the whole video. I'll have to look that up in my little dictionary. I'll see you when I see you. Bye.